Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today I am doing the how I did my makeup in high school tag or challenge or whatever it is, and I really did not plan on doing this, but I thought that I would just because I was thinking about how I used to do my makeup and it made me cringe and die a little on the inside. So I figured I would go ahead and upload this, and it's pretty easy, pretty bad, but pretty easy. So I'm gonna go ahead and zoom you in and show you, but I also want you to realize that Oh my gosh, everything has changed and everything is so much better. But if you are in high school, don't feel too bad because we've all been there. We've all done our makeup that way and it's not that bad. But I'd like to think that my makeup has improved a little bit over the years. And I am already wearing um, mascara because I did go out today. And right now it's like midnight and I'm recording this video. But anyways, just let me jump into the video. And yeah, I will see you in a second. Okay guys, so every morning when I would wake up, the first thing I would do is give myself a horrible amount of foundation and I would use an off color and just cheap because I was really cheap back in high school and didn't want to waste my money. And honestly, this wasn't really high school because in high school I wasn't wearing that much makeup. I would wear a little bit of eyeliner and then mascara and foundation. But when I first started doing makeup, that's kind of what I'm basing this off of. So first thing I would do is plop some in my hand because I did not use brushes or a blend, a beauty blender or anything. And I always bought my foundation in the wrong color. I always bought it either way too light or way too dark. And this one just happens to be way too light. Oh my gosh, I don't know how I used to do this without a brush. How do you do this? Ugh, it feels like there's so much product on my face right now. Oh, and when I was in probably junior high, probably eighth grade, I would never actually put foundation on my forehead because I had bangs that covered it. So I was just like, eh, I don't need it. So I would just never do that. I just put it everywhere else. And I think it's because I was afraid I would get it in my hair and I was way too lazy to actually take care of that. Oh my gosh. I feel like I look like a ghost. What the heck? This is bad. Anyway, so I remember using cheap brands. I don't remember what brands I used though when I was in high school. I don't remember. Okay. Where the heck is my other stuff? So every day I would use one of two colors and it just depended on the day. So I would either use purple every single day or I would use browns. And I'm not talking about light purple or light brown, I'm talking dark, like really dark. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. So give me one second. Oh, and also I would not ever use brushes or anything, but if I did it was like the little ones that would come in the actual little palette. And I remember when I would put this on, I always wore purple because it was supposed to make my eyes pop. But when I got a little bit older, I wanted to use brown because I thought purple was too childish and not good enough. And then after all that, I just switched to eyeliner because I felt like eyeshadow took too long in the morning before school. I was too lazy to get up and do that. Not as bad as I thought it would be. So you can see already it's starting to look a little bit dark. Now if I had it available, instead of using actual eyeshadows, I would use um, the marker type things like this and I would put it all over the top. So I'm going to do a little bit of that and just like blend it with my finger a little bit even though I didn't do much blending back then, but I'm going to go ahead and do that just to add a little extra. And 
And no joke, I would use the jumbo purple markers to do this. Like the ones that you buy in the makeup aisle, but still. Come to think of it, I actually don't remember anyone else using those but me. Okay, so that's about what you would end up with, is just a very dark mess, obviously, you can see that. And I would not do anything to my eyebrows at all. Like, I wouldn't touch them with anything. Except for when I probably turned 16, I would start combing them out with an actual comb just to keep them more in... in shape. <laughs> I don't know what I'm trying to say. What the heck? Anyways, so that is what I would do to my eyelids. Now, if I was really feeling like sassy that day and wanted to look really especially good, I would go in with eyeliner, which I'm gonna show you right now. So I always use the Rimmel um, eyeliner, just like the regular eyeliner, but I don't have that right now. I'm out of it and I haven't replaced it. And I still use that, but I use it in different ways now. But you can see right here, I have the Marc Jacobs one and I'm just gonna go in and do that. Okay, so this is how I would do my eyeliner, and this was basically what I would do for the day. Now, some days I would put on mascara and actually take the time to do that, but other days I was like, eh, it's not worth it, so I wouldn't put on mascara, and I would just leave my eyes looking like this, which is crazy. I can't imagine leaving without putting on mascara, because I feel like that's the one thing that kind of makes people look better and not so crazy. But anyways, this is basically all I did, and then every single day I actually straightened my hair, like, as straight as I could, like, as flat to my head as I could, but... Uh, I didn't straighten my hair today. Anyways, this is basically what it, what it was, you know? And looking back now, I cringe. I remember looking at um, pictures from my cousin's wedding when I had like super dark eyeliner. I had top and bottom, I think, and I wouldn't use like a gel eyeliner to apply it, obviously. I would just use like a regular pencil to put it on and it was not a good look. And if I remember and can find pictures, I will try to insert them here so that you can uh, enjoy that makeup back then. But anyways guys, this is it for this video. I know that it was super quick, but I mean there's not much to show when you did the same thing every single day and didn't know much about makeup. But if you got a laugh out of this or just enjoyed watching me make a fool out of myself or anything like that, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Make sure that you leave a comment down below and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!